So he just bought like and just put it in here and like he just got it. Rounds, you gotta be cheats. Sack of Surprise give you a port? I haven't played Sack of Surprise today. Expensive. Okay, let's see, let's see. Dagger is four gold. This is two, this is four. That's 10. So we need a two gold item, which we could just buy as a lump of coal. I'm gonna put all that in there. And I guess with the remaining of our gold, we'll just try to make good choices. Paying for four, but I just want 12 gold, right? I don't want to go over 12. My math is right, right? Four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Oh, you need 13 or more? Oh. I guess I'll put this pig in there then. So four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. But you normally buy a load of cars and reserve all but one item in the shop and then reroll. What do you mean? You normally buy a load of cards, a load of customer cards, then reserve all but one item in the shop, and then roll? Oh. <laughs> so that's like a way of like, just, you keep upgrading the item. All the way to godly. And you just keep rolling until you roll a godly prismatic orb. And then the amount of the amount of customer cards you have will depend on how many rolls you're you're going to do, right? How many godly items are there in the game? Damn. But you can't you can't get combinations, crafted items from the shop. And this is what the is well, you can't get these in the shop either. So you will only be rolling these. That's kind of, I'm not going to cap. That's kind of smart. That's kind of smart. I like that. <laughs> I haven't tried it much as it feels cheaty. That's kind of smart. I think that's a strat. But like, I feel like this is an expensive one because you have to get like, I would say at like at least four. I'd say you need at least four customer cards to try something like that. Prismatic orb round two? Nope, it gave me bullshit. <laughs> Okay, maybe not. This isn't that bad, I guess. I need a weapon though. We definitely lost. I need, I need stamina. Forgot all about stamina. Three gold item? Double garlics? I think I'll take double garlics though. I'll take the double garlic. Garlic is funny. You could have gave me like a banana or something. 
Yeah, I don't know how to play this. <laughs> I don't know how to play this bag. I feel like I gotta be doing something wrong. You're back? Welcome back. It's like I'm too focused on the bag and not actually building like an actual legitimate like you know build that's what it feels like at least i was like why did it give me a six gold item it's because i put the freaking the thing in there Fire, what's up? How's it going? It's a sell item bin. Transmute half price into full price. Yeah, I'm not getting any sell items. <laughs> Unless you're saying I shouldn't use it at all, except for sell items, like when I get a sell item. Is that what you're saying? Never put flames on the bag. Flames don't count to math. Oh, what? <laughs> so they don't they don't count as one gold. So it's useless. <laughs> they actually don't count as one gold. So it's like, oh man. What the fuck? <laughs> what? What just happened? Why did I get two mana orbs? So the... <laughs> the... The discombobulator was six gold, so it sacrificed itself, and an offering bowl also sacrificed the discombobulator, which was another six gold. Mana bomb, GG, mana bomb. <laughs> As soon as you see a fucking mana orb, you're just like, oh, good game. We win, you lose, mana bomb. I don't know what I was trying to do here. I kind of do know what I'm trying to do. I'll do this. That's, you know what? I'm not going to break my brain. I like it. I like my brain. That's got to be a bug, surely. I don't know. The math was math thing though, right? You can still lock it after the fight before you go back to uh, shop. Are you talking about the flame? Yeah. <laughs> True. But yeah, the math was mathing. The discombobulator was six gold and it sacrificed itself. And then the bowl was also sacrificed to six gold and both of the orbs are six gold. I feel like the math was mathing. Damn it, I should have got me a flame whip. What was I thinking? It was right there. I should have gotten a flame thing. I kind of want to buy it again. I'm not going to lie. Whoa. 
So this is 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Well, minus one, so 14, basically. I could have gotten more activators on that. <laughs> Sacrificing flames only makes flames count to zero. But with other items that is not fire items, flames count. Oh, we're not selling for flames to a freed item. Gotcha. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. So if I only put like one singular flame in there, then like that's bad, basically. Or if I put multiple flames in there, that's good. What do I get here? Loki fill in a nice frozen flame. What if I put this in here? <laughs> it's on sale. What if I just put the sale item in there to say fuck it? Let's put the sale item in there. It's harder to find a build when you just try to sell stuff. Yeah, it is a lot harder. We really don't even have a build for real. Oh, the flames count as zero because each flame is one. So it just goes to negative one. I think all these transmute items are just good tempo and random pivots. And less like actually trying to build something like a like a strategy with it or something, right? But if not, flames are one. So if I put this goober in here with a flame, it'll be seven gold, right? I'm going to try this just because it'll be cool. Lop the class out? No, listen, 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 listen. Listen, 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 listen. It's okay. It's okay. It'll work. It's going to work. <laughs> I, I do not want dragons. I don't want any dragons. I'll, I don't want any dragons. It's, I mean, maybe, I mean, <laughs> if I find a dragon on sale, I'll sacrifice it. How about that? Wait, it's 10 gold. Yes. Put more items in! <laughs> yes. You put a fucking shell in there. Put a shell in there. But this is a blueberry. It's like my only one other source of generation. Whoa. Alright, we sacrifice the class item. You always sacrifice your class item with this class, okay? Your class item is the bowl. Not anything else. Always sacrifice your class item, no matter what. It's worth it in the, at the end. But we still got a dragon. Got a fucking great sword. Hell yeah. <laughs> they all, I just everything I ever wanted. Everything I ever wanted. A great sword. Oh my god. The best item to get. I couldn't ask for a greater item. I'm about to get this stored. <laughs> Is it worth buying this just literally just to put it inside the offering bowl? Yes. 
The answer is yes. And always yes. 100% worth it. Look, he's doing the same thing. He knows what's up. Hell yeah. Let's go. We beat a rapier. <laughs> Alright, give me something amazing. What the fuck is that? What is that? <laughs> I sacrificed... I sacrificed 22 gold. And you gave me this? This is horrible. <laughs> what the... like top worst items in the game and she's just like here you go like why 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 did that on purpose the top top worst items in the game is what i just got i'm sorry <laughs> i'm buying this you're gonna go right there all i need is my sapphire being super fast and that is Infinite vampirism, if I've ever seen. You don't have glow regeneration. You barely have glow regeneration. Why are we winning? Why is this happening? Hey! That's a crown. I'll keep a crown. <laughs> yes. It's just going to keep going up and up and up. Up and up and up. Does the does the platinum card increase your chance of getting a sell item? Hmm. Oh, it is a crafted item. It does not. It does not. I thought it did for some reason. Holy stamina. <laughs> I know, right? This guy's working overtime. It's okay. He knows the deal. He knows what to do. He's not there for no reason. He's got this. Protect, not reflect. Protect. C, C. Holy stamina for him too, right? No, not really. <laughs> Let's go. See? He knows what to do. Who needs stamina? We got a single B Nance. That's all the stamina you need. Damn! You can get backpacks from this? That's a thing. All right, you're getting sacrificed. Should I sacrifice this holy armor? Probably. I don't really need it. You're getting sacrificed. And then the piggy. Oh wait, I can make a sun armor. I just realized that. Okay, maybe you don't get sacrificed. Maybe you're, uh, maybe you're sun armor. It's disgusting that this is winning. I know, right? Oh, here's where we lose. <laughs> yeah, here's definitely where we lose. Double chili goober on a burning banner with a bloodthorn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Hey, 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 hey. 
I always bet on me. Right. You know the drill. <laughs> Except when we go against that. And then we're fucked. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't need two of these. Three sun armors? Let's do it. We're doing three sun armors and no one can stop me. No one can stop me. I need so much space right now. <laughs> I need so much space. We're buying this prismatic orb just to, just to sacrifice it for space. Because, uh, you know, it gives you space. So, like, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We're gonna get space here, and we'll be fine. Another Bloodthorn. Here we go. Give me space. Fuck. Do I sell this or do I sacrifice it? I sell these. How do I like... Wait, no, it's not gonna sacrifice this, right? Wait, can it do a combination in this? No, it can't, right? Yeah, it can't. I was gonna say, can it do a sacrifice and a combination at the same time? Probably not, no. No, I'm not gonna settle, actually. <laughs> yeah, we definitely need a lot more heat generation. <laughs> Three sun armors. <laughs> Three sun armors and a fire staff. Our heat generation is dying. Why are you making me so slow? Three health. Oh, you died. Awesome. I have four customer cards. No, I don't. No, I don't. I thought I did. Now I do, or will. Fuck it. Oh, I have five of these. What the fuck? I have five customer cards. All right, we're gonna try it. <laughs> we're gonna fucking, we're gonna try the thing you were talking about. We're gonna try the thing. <laughs> All right, it's, it's gonna be foolproof. A foolproof plan. <laughs> this is such a stupid build. Our heat generation, no! Oh no, we're definitely losing. All these sun armors, you can't heal? Pathetic. How dare you? How dare you? Alright. We're locking every item. Well, that was fast. <laughs> Wait, if I, I'm gonna do it again and I'll get another godly item, right? And I'll just keep doing it until I gave me a prismatic orb. Didn't get one. <laughs> God damn it. I needed that. No, I don't. <laughs> you gotta be... You gotta do stupid stuff sometimes. Right, exactly. Exactly. That could low-key, like, I could just imagine that. You get a prismatic orb to get the prismatic sword, and like in the last four to three rounds, you just do that strategy, 
to get as many prismatic orbs as you possibly can to just stack onto like that prismatic sword. Like that's, that's definitely a strat. You don't even need five. I'd say you could get away with three customer cards doing that and just keep re-rolling. Why do I have three sun armors? Who told me to do this? Which one of you, which one of you convinced me of such tomfoolery? We can sacrifice three of them. Let's see what happens. Yes! <sighs> one more hit, one more hit. One more. We would have had it. This is the... The game doesn't like me. It keeps giving me BS. Um, how am I going to do this? Saber? Question mark? No. I don't even need a banana. Fuck the banana. All my homies hate them. I'll do this though. Well, I should probably do this that this round, right? Is that even possible? Is it even possible for me to get that this round? I can with the customer cards, but can I actually like sacrifice you? Probably not. Nope. So many trumpets, right? Like when was the last time somebody used a trumpet in a build? Okay, he hurts. He hurts. We lose. <laughs> it's okay, because we've been preparing for this last round this entire time. Ripshaw Blade, let's go. It's exactly what I needed. Twenty-five gold. What do you want for twenty-five gold? Legendary. I want a prismatic orb. Give me a prismatic. Thank you. Why did I want a prismatic orb? Don't know, but I just wanted one just to have one. <laughs> Ripshot needs a recipe. It really kind of does, honestly. Like, it'd be kind of cool if it had one. No way that procs anyway. What proc? Which proc? I don't know what proc. All right, unless you're talking about the prismatic orb. All right, let's see who we go against. A big thorny with an unselling present. This uses up mana? No, it doesn't. Why do you have so much mana generation? I guess for the mana orb procs. Only thing I can think of. Dude! Dude! 
Dude. Dude. As soon as that mana ward price, he's going to heal so much. 69. Die. Let's go. We win. It was all worth it. All three holy armors. All three freaking holy armors. <laughs> That's I've never seen three holy armors. Sun armor. Sorry. <laughs> all three sun armors. Hey, the prismatic or was clutch last round, though. It was pretty clutchy and our heat generation was nice. The mana generation is nice. This is a 10 out of 10 build. Definitely no RNG included. Not a single lick of RNG. All skill. All three of them completely necessary? Yes. All three. I needed this much healing and it's the best healing in the game. So it was very, very, very necessary. Very necessary.